Sometimes you can come across some more challenging products to shoot with reflective bits on them that might need a little bit more help. So I'm going to give you a few tips on how to help in those areas. As you can see, there's a lot of work to be done in these shiny areas and the shoe is really not looking its best. So what can we do? Well, using diffusion material in front of the lamps, what we can do is we can control the reflections and how harsh they are and we can spread the light. Where we have this reflection here in the metal, if I then take the diffuser and pop it in front, what you'll see there is it really cleans up that metal diffuses the whole lamp right across so we get a nice graduated tone. So there we go, without and with. We also have these highlights here that we want to deal with. They're a little bit hard. So what we want to do is also, using another diffuser on the other side, pop that in. It's making a really nice highlight down this edge much softer, not so hard. Just for a much more smooth and even look. So again, this is without. This is with. And that's looking a lot better. We can also use white material to reflect into uh, things like metal. Um, to really bring a, a natural tone back into them. So using a diffuser material like this diffuser here, what we can do is act as the clouds in front of the sun and soften down the shadows. We can also use the white reflector material to reflect into the shiny surfaces, adding, uh, as it were, white, but in a very graduated way into that area so it looks really nice and metallic again.